Greetings. Ooh. Not a bad. Mmm, rage increase, but the armor is lame. Meh. Let's go Necropolis level 11 that I missed. Kek. Uh, complete the map without upgrading traps, bro. <laughs> that would be pretty hard. But I might actually do it. Let's try and do it, maybe. But I think you'd need like more uh, trap upgrades in with the trap points. Oh shit. Wait, I think there's a wasp on the, on the window. Time to earn some more gold, right? Just saved a honeybee. What a cutie. Uh, okay, so. What's the, the volume? Okay, this will be amazing. Oh, if I didn't upgrade any traps. I mean, I can just spam them, right? <laughs> Is Swarm better in this case? I mean, it would just have like 2k HP plus 100 damage. I think this will be better. I mean, same price, but I feel like this would be... Well, it's 10 second clock, like, eh, let's try it out. Shizzle. I'm a build wait, I'm a build around the base. First. Okay, bro, this will be fun. Fantastic. Come on, I can do this. Let's get the loot. Okay, hard to see the map now. Wait a second. Oh shit. I like wanna go 
Traps, so little time. She. Hmm. Oh. Branches out here to the left side. Complete the map without upgrading any of your trap. Okay. So any traps. It doesn't mean towers or just like floor traps. traps. left side is like fully almost okay so like bottom left is not equipped with traps I mean okay yeah almost more essence. That actually exploded it, dude. This one. Remember to like always a good middle with like most of the crap like a first. Because that will help to delete all of them baddies. This is not really needed at the time. The middle part, I would suggest, like I said, putting a lot of damaging traps. Well, I hope these yeah. traps work. The monsters are coming.
I knew it. That was something. Because it lacked like a little bit of damage, and I was like, yep. I mean, it is all, almost fully automated, or maybe it is actually fully automated. So, wait, where haven't I put the towers? Okay, so when you press M, you can see that. Come on, don't misclick, please. Okay, um, most of them are still coming through the left side. It's equipped, equipped. I love this minimap, like it shows you where the traps are to place. <laughs> and when you haven't, that's extremely good, like... A lot of child defense games should learn from this game because this one is really, 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 really good. What else? We should go all the way bottom. Not needed, but. It's all good. I'm thinking if I should play. Wait a second. This is it? I wish it would show like how many traps I can place and because it seems like I've covered the whole map already. I'm ready to fight. Anyway, so I'm thinking about like this game has uh, the death trap is like a mini game of a another game. It's called Van Helsing stuff. Okay, uh, awesome adventures of Van Helsing. Not awesome, but like. Something Adventures of One Helsing. I was thinking maybe we should complete that game too. Because the graphics, I mean, the engine is like the same. And um, the atmosphere is the same. Like, pretty grim. The colors are like almost non existent, as you can see. So, like, I mean, they are existent, but like, you know, it's like not pale, but how, how do I want to say dull? Yeah, pretty dull. It's not bright. So yeah. I'm thinking if I should play the game. Because I mean, okay, I maybe I won't. It's just meh. I completed it once already. In the previous gaming channel, but Like, I don't know, I just don't feel like playing it. I mean, it, that game is a 7, like a solid 6.5. Oh shit, is that what the fuck? It's smaller than dying. Who's the zapper? It's like a children. So, I don't know, I don't really feel like it I might though. Or maybe I'll play Sunday later when I don't have anything. 
playing. I don't even have any points else besides this game at the moment. So, I mean, I have uh, Slay the Spire and Oopsies, misclick. It's last wave, so I guess. It's like, I have Slay the Spire and Grim Dawn, but I can't play Grim Dawn. That's why I was thinking about that person. I can play because of the PC that I own right now. Like, for the um, outrage. And basically, the game stutters when I'm recording. So it's really like, um. I mean, it's really discouraging to play a game that isn't playing smooth <laughs> as I would wish it to be. I mean, not that I'm like. Oh shit, what the fuck? Will Mark didn't show this? Or did it? So, yeah, you know. Like, I wanna. Like, I really want to play it, but. I can live without it a little bit, I guess. I mean, it's just it's, it's the, literally the best RPG in the world. Top one, no better than it. Path of Exile is trash. You're me right. It's, it's shit. It's lack of everything. Lack of content. Lack of the fucking story. Lack of. It's it's just like mindless. It's just like torchlight. It's trash. You just play just to smash creeps and that's it. Like you know, like there's no brains. You don't need brains to play. You just need. I mean, uh, you just need two cells maybe to like calculate basic mathematics. <laughs> like yeah, this is a pretty shit game. Very uninspiring. I would rather play Torchlight on Path of Exile, I think. Because Path of Exile is trying to be something that's not like an interesting game. Content upgrades, updates are like overhyped. Like, oh, we're adding one feature, yo. You should play a new run just to like experience it. And what it does is like, it just gives you a tiny bit of. I mean, overall, it adds up, you know. All the little updates, all the new features, they add up into like having a character like super OP in the late game. But like, no. Like, I ain't gonna wait two years to like go to. I mean, no, I'm kidding. It's like a long time to maybe get to the highest level. Basically, just no. Big no no for me. Wait, this is the last wave and this is the last creep? What the fuck? How did I miss this? The map didn't show me that they can place there or some shit, I don't know. What if this can kill you? These are air units, well. Okay, I'm gonna let it come on this fire trap. This whole like section. Now I'm gonna defeat it. Oh shit. Where's the mouse? Okay, now I see. This bitch is doing like uh... I, I didn't use the potion yet. It's doing the fucking... Push away, like knock back. Okay, I'm gonna just boost it. Okay, now I'm gonna potion. Wait, where the fuck is the boss? Did I kill it? 
bro, no upgrades. I did the quest too. Got like three levels or some shit. No, one level. Bro, that's cool. Just collect it while it's dropping so it wouldn't fall or some shit. Bro, look at that essence. Nice, the quest complete. Why uh. 5 of 5 on hard? Boom! Three stars, even level up. So this was my whole build for like the whole game, kinda. No upgrade on damaging skills, no essence here and stuff. No buff upgrades, just like XP. Basically did it naked. Because if I didn't go the XP, like I completed levels on hard, right? <laughs> and on like 99% of them, I didn't even get any XP. So if I wouldn't go with the uh, XP bonuses, then I would be like level 20 at maybe right now. or may Actually, maybe like... I with the buffs I gained maybe two levels or something I don't know what I'm saying is if I didn't upgrade these then I would be like uh, my character would be like around level 19 to 22 or uh, around 20 probably and also I would have had like maybe more damaging spells and or I mean if we didn't have this too because look at the gold if I didn't upgrade these then it would be more efficient and like basically everything would be cheaper yeah I would have completed those levels even way higher basically this is where resistance is all thing. Holy shit! So, but it it's just the base, you know, base resistance. The resistance was around one hundred, I think. So this fully upgraded, I think. No, if fifty, so my plus plus hundred per hundred fifty. If fully upgrade, I think yeah. It's pretty useful. Also, if like rage and yeah, I, I could have done it to like more damage, but I went for like full eco and survivability. But if I would do it with damage, it would have been way more easier for me to defeat the whole game. Got some points, I don't even know. Oh, yeah, leveled up to 25. So now I can upgrade the damage. On these traps. Crossbow. I mean, my set of items, it's not a bad, actually. Survivability, a lot of damage, gold find, crit hit chance, and resi resistances, and skill cooldown reduction is really good. D these I like a lot. Except for the mine. Take mine dispenser, lol. So this is it guys, I think I won't play it anymore. Would be nice if there was like more crafting in this game. I mean at level 55 or stuff you get like super items. Not super items but they are orange in the name as far as I remember. They're like orange, not purple or like blue or whatever. This so everything's completed. This you can complete. This is just to compete. So scenario difficulty. What is that? 
Well, does it give you nines? Nah. I don't know. Your base started with less. What the fuck? Oh. So if you like play this, then don't leak at all. Which is actually good. So this is just gold. This is just better drops. I remember playing with... What did I play with? Oh shit, this is pretty bad. I think I played like this. With that. Oh man, this is actually good too because if they respawn, you basically get more essence and more XP. Push is less effective. I think I maybe played with this too, or maybe not as much with that. And this one too, yeah. Some shit like that. It was around that, I think. But yeah, these are like. I don't like the hollow grounds because it's very annoying. It's like Necropolis map, I think. So, yeah, this is it. Thanks for watching. <sighs> See you next time. Or maybe next game. <laughs>